or above all, of course, this is a conversation between the reader and the writer. All the information we know are not available online, including his feelings and opinions towards some particular issues. In order to ask the right questions and ask questions in the right way, you know, we had a discussion ahead of sending email to Mr. Neville. We are assigned to different questions respectively to avoid having the same and repetitive inquiries. In the whole process of doing this project, I started to read more articles about Southeast Asia and pay extra attention to Malaysia, so that I could equip more background knowledge before I communicated with Mr. Level. Particular cautious、uh, when the issues is involved in the Muslim people, right?、But、why did you change the headline if you still re-、uh, remember the story? More importantly, this is also a conversation between a current journalist and a future journalist. It is not only what he answers matters, but also what he did not answer when he did not reply our emails. Maybe he's too busy. Maybe he's too sensitive. Then we have to ponder what's the strategy to communicate with him. It is this communication part made the whole project so interesting. It's interesting, helpful, and unforgettable.